All right, so I kind of think about ball handling a little bit weird. Each of these trees, there's a bunch of trees out here, right? I see a crossover. I see a behind the back, in and out. I'm just weird like this, right? So this tree right here, I just see it between the legs. Strongest part of the tree is the base right there. And it goes into the ground, spreads out. But as visually, as far as we can see, this is the strongest part of the tree. The between the leg, that's just the between the legs. Now, as we start going up, it turns to a crossover. Now, this may branch off into a between the legs behind the back, between the legs in and out, whatever, right? But now, as it starts branching off even more, the uh, branches start getting a little bit skinnier. They turn into little baby sticks, right? So that means kind of like the moves are getting weaker, like you're dribbling too much, you're adding too much to your actual move. You really only need that between the legs to start off with. But as far as creativity goes, I want to like start playing with this and seeing what works, what doesn't, and just keep adding to the bag, right? And so what I'll do is I have my little, little journal or whatever, and I consider this is my cookbook, right? So I'll go through it and just write down each move, okay, between the legs, between the legs crossover, between the legs crossover snatch, okay, maybe the, okay, different type of snatch, you know what I'm saying? And then we'll go through it. And this, this is kind of how I look at moves, so. I'm gonna start off with this heavy basketball that we just got in and get a little workout, just mess around, see what we can come up with. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, five. One, back. Between the last cross over to them. Switch it.
that's the end of the workout. Try to go through it without stopping. I'm not even at that point, nor is he, but it's definitely a good work, a good workout. Copy your heavy basketballs on interlab.tv and I'll be sending you workouts. You become a part of this email list. I'll be sending you all kind of workouts that you could do with the heavy basketball and we'll get better together, all right? What I want you to do is search down the list. We've got a lot of videos for you to watch. Thanks for tuning in and don't forget, like, subscribe, comment, all that. Now, before you move on to the next video, what I want to do is send out an invite to anybody out there trying to get their game right and are really taking this game of basketball seriously. What I want to do is create a basketball army for players that can dribble, shoot, defend, have a high cue, all of that. I'm going to be your trainer inside the academy. It's now available on Android, iPhone, tablets, Apple TV, you name it, it's probably on there. So. I'm looking forward to building everything about you as far as a basketball player. We have Zoom sessions twice a month so we can actually have that interaction between player and trainer to make sure that you guys get better. I want to build a relationship and just really see you through your basketball career no matter what level that you're playing at. So if you go on academy uh, season 2intheLab.tv there will be a video explaining everything. You can sign up on our website and then it'll give you like you'll be able to download the app. And it's super easy to use, super fast. We also have a series on there called Progress. That'll be the prelude to the next 10,000 hours season. We're doing chapter two of 10,000 hours coming up soon, but this is the groundwork that's gonna go into it beforehand because we need to actually create a story. As a trainer, I need to actually make sure that there are players getting better because this is not all for show. So if you're serious, I want you guys to go sign up for the Academy season two and let me help you get your game right.